Hello again, really nice to be able to talk to you, uh, following on from my video uh, at the end of the last half term. Uh, really importantly, hope that you and your families are staying safe and well. Uh, this obviously has been a, a really uh, interesting week in, in lots of ways, uh, primarily because actually uh, it may have been um, the opportunity for some of the year sixes who are coming to us to return to their primary school for the first time since March. Uh, for those children who have, I hope you've had an enjoyable week. Um, and for those children who are still to return, uh, if you are going to, um, hope that you enjoy having some sort of normality back. Uh, into what you do. What are we doing here then? Well, lots going on in the academy uh, to um, deliver what we're calling our virtual transition. Sadly, children in year six won't be coming into the academy before uh, the, the summer holidays. However, uh, Mrs. Garrity has been working with lots of different people here at the academy to be able uh, to create what we're calling our virtual transition journey. And what that's going to involve is lots of different people in the academy uh, making some videos to share with you so that you can learn as much as you can about what life at the Academy will be like. So I know for a fact, uh, for, for all of our um, New Year 7 students, Miss Dawson, one of our science teachers, has um, created a uh, virtual science lesson today, uh, which has been shared on our social media with you. That's one that you should really have a look at. It'll give you a flavour of what a science lesson here at the Academy uh, might be like. Um, and also linked with that, um, there's some uh, new science work. Uh, we all know, of course, that the maths and English work has been going out. That's really important. would really encourage you to engage with that um, and, and, and do as much of that as possible, because in doing that, you'll give yourself the best opportunity uh, for a really good start uh, in September. Uh, what else is going on? Well, over the coming weeks, more and more of these videos will get uh, drip fed out to you via our social media platforms, uh, Twitter, Facebook, so that you can get to know more and more uh, of the faces that you're going to see, understand more and more what life will be like here, so that uh, by the time we get to the summer holiday, you've got a really clear picture of what life uh, in year seven will be like here at Cove Academy Stoke on Trent. Um, other things going on, which I think is really important to share with. Uh, with, with everybody, parents and children. We've been doing lots of work here at the Academy uh, to um, make it what we call COVID secure, essentially. The term that means that we're putting in lots of social distancing measures uh, to ensure that uh, when children come back to us, they can be confident and their parents can be confident that this is a really safe place for them to be because that's what's important we want i want to communicate that with you today uh so that you're really clear that you know we've done lots of things uh, markings on the floor uh adjustment to classroom sizes so that we can make sure that uh when children join us uh they can focus on what really matters which is their learning and uh getting to grips with a new environment um uh, as, as they start secondary school which you know for anybody at any time is a massive step, but one we're really confident uh, we can make as seamless as possible. With that in mind, uh, something that I just wanted to share with you is that we've taken the decision that uh, to begin with, what we're going to do is we're going to um, keep uh, children in their primary school classes in their tutor groups to start with. Why are we doing this? Well, because we think that this is already quite an uncertain time uh, because of everything that's going on around us and also because actually the move to secondary school can be quite daunting now we're doing lots and lots to try and remove as many of the the reasons why that will be so with our videos and by sending out um, our work packs and uh, communicating with you regularly but we also recognize these are different times as well in the sense that it's the combination of uh, what's going on in in, in the wider uh, community and also the fact that uh, people will be naturally anxious about coming to, to secondary school. So we've taken the decision actually that what we're going to do is we're going to keep children in those primary school classes uh, when they when they come to us um, for the first period of time uh, in September. And we just hope that's um, going to be one other thing uh, that will provide reassurance to children coming from year six into year seven. Okay. Um, that really is all I had to update you on today, um, but I will be sending out some more videos as time goes by. Um, and of course, Mrs. Garrity continues to, uh, uh, you know, 
run the run the transition program to give you as much information as possible. The final thing I do want to just uh, politely remind people about is those forms that we've sent out via the uh, Google form to your email addresses. Those are really, really important. We need those back um, as promptly as possible, please. So I would ask for your help and uh, support in getting those done, um, because what that means is uh, that we can uh, get as much information about your child uh, onto our systems to give them the best possible start. OK, thank you. So in conclusion, and all that remains for me to say is, very best wishes from all of us here. Take care. Really excited, uh, as I've said before, about welcoming New Year 7 into our school. And in the meantime, take care and stay safe. Thank you.